wrap up Wave A. There were too many good matches yeah. in Wave A to leave this one unnoticed and unscreened. Yeah. We have Chase and Kless. Yeah, so this is the last set of Wave A. We got both the up and comers, uh, both two, are new to off the one, competition. Go. They've been making super big strides lately, especially off of the head. Oh, that's right, that's right. And of course, you know, being a Terry player that blesses, he's already, man, going after my own heart. You can give someone the jab, jab, power dunk, or the Buster Wolf or a power wave. Yeah, I'm, I'm all about it. So right now, I'm opening up with 50, and uh, what it looks like is going to happen is actually going to happen. I was going to have a really good time to do it with Terry, but what if Terry gets to do it? Honestly, I'm looking for Kles because we know that Chase is going to be doing those cross of nares, pressuring the heal as, as much as, as uh, Chase can. But I'm waiting for Kles to utilize the spot dodge up tilt that's like vulnerable and see if he can actually punish Paul Tano. Maybe like, you know, stop pull back a bit because I have this tool that you're not used to. The problem with that is that Paolo is really good at spot dodge and punishing the first time. Ed Tilt into Crag 2, such a great tool, and totally safe too. It's such a good mix up. Just how how adept he is to using those charge those charge inputs. He's, he's always like he's, it almost looks like he's like falling for just a split second, and then all of a sudden that charge up comes out full on vulnerability. And there you go, catching with the up air chase, eliminating the first lock, and more importantly, getting rid of that go. Yeah, that that is super important. But he did a lot of damage that stock. I think with Terry, if he can get rid of go, he can still kill you. Oh, definitely. Where are you at? Center stage? All right, don't worry. We're, we're going up B. Yeah. Yeah, another jab jab up B. Seems to be a good positioning for Plus. But here we go, go time. Like, I'm right in front, no punish, no grab, nothing. I think they dropped the leg, yeah. How do you hit? Oh, he's good. Oh, he's good. Oh, he's good. Oh, he's good. Dude, dude. Everyone says Terry has recovery. And honestly, I call it the Little Mac treatment. Everyone says the character has bad recovery. No, this character's recovery it's, is godlike. You just don't have to know how to use it. It's it's so black and white to say character has bad, bad recovery. If you can abuse what they have, then yes. But Terry has a lot of options, so you have to cover all of them. If you yeah, cover yeah, all of them, you can, you can abuse his recovery. But, but it's a, at that point, like, he also has like multiple options that he's gonna choose. Does he do? Does he do a power dunk first and yeah. then to to crack shoot? Does he do bust uh, yeah. burn knuckle? Yeah. He's got so many options to go up, oh. down, left, right that you just have to guess right. But there you go. There's oh the back God. throw. Super important grab because he had to go right there. I think he was gonna let it rip. Oh, he was already spamming those power waves or the the power geysers. <laughs> yeah. Hey, but still, Chase has got to make up 90 percent, and I think. Plus, we'll probably start to get some confirms here that'll kill. Oh, yeah, jab, you know, enemy. especially with the way that Chase is staying center stage, you know that Kles is looking for jab, jab, up e again. We'll see. It's, it's an SDI mix-up, I think. So, like, if you start to SDI away, I think you can get power dunk. But if you SDI in, you can get up e easier. But I think the up e works either way. I'm not sure. Yeah, so. I'm pretty sure that the up e works either way. Oh, but there's the that, down yeah. tilt, the double down tilt, the burning knuckle. Yeah. A personal favorite of my of my <laughs> own. <laughs> yeah, they're running it back. I saw the, the run back symbol. Yeah, I mean, I think Kles even got like second at a tournament yesterday. Yeah, or? He, I, uh, I don't know. I don't know what day it was, but I saw over the weekend he did. Uh, he yeah, like overcoming players. Zenyu and, and was it uh, was it was it Syro? I think he beat Syro. Syro, that's oh, what it okay, was. Okay. Syro, yes. Oh. 
But we're seeing with the Palu. I know Chase has a lot of other characters. We're seeing the Palu. And Class has mostly just been Terry recently. And, and Terry. He's, he's really good. If, if he is adept as fighting game characters as you say he is, I really yes, want to yeah. see what he can do with Kazuya. But the Maybe not today. <laughs> the thing is, he's not only limited to fighting players or characters. Because before that, he's Cloud, too. So it's not like, oh. you know. <laughs> he's, he's Tell me he played Roy, too. I, I, don't, I don't know about that. <laughs> all I do know is that he's got some funsies. That's yeah, all I do know. He's got some funsies. You can yeah. tell he's got the spacing and everything else. Okay, and good good trade going in Chase's favor. Completely different opening than the last game. But Class has go right now. He's going to have to use that if he wants to make a comeback. And Terry can definitely make a comeback. But how at the ledge, we didn't really get to see Chase uh, abuse ledge trapping against Kles the last game. Honestly, was, like, I feel like it's more of Kles's, uh patience and like yeah. really utilizing yeah. or trying to see what options Chase is going to pick. As you can see right there, he yeah, let yeah. it be ripped uh, as, soon as, as soon as Chase was still stuck in recovery. I, I feel like, oh, I feel like every time Chase gets Kles to the ledge, he, he's standing too close. He's like either standing too close or he like goes off. Even when he run off fun. nares, it doesn't really work out for him because we see the invulnerable up B. Ooh, okay. It's because every time Chase hits him off, or not every time, a lot of times when Chase hits him off stage, that's going to be it. A lot of times Chase hits him off the stage, he doesn't have enough time to position himself. Mm. So sometimes he overshoots. That's, that's why he's standing too close. But there was that one time he got the counter. That yeah. was nice. Yeah, that was good. But he had enough time to set it up. Mm -hmm. Okay, we got oh, oh. almost an airstring. Still an airstring. <laughs> okay, yeah, see? definitely not as much damage as he could have gotten, yeah. but the platform interrupting, unfortunately, for, for Chase. Okay, Ooh, class. tried to cast the jumps. Yeah. Now we're going to see. Oh, that, that might be it. That's going to be it. Oh, man. And you know what's sad is that Chase had the right idea. He knew to bait out Kles to go for up B, pick an offensive option, and then punish him, but his punish was just mistimed. I, I mean, he explosive flame, right? I think he just chose the wrong button. I, I think I don't know if he knew Kles was going to be right there. Okay. Um, I mean, Chase was down pretty much the entire game last, last game. So we're going to see if he can slowly build up the stock. He's got to get the stock before ghost shenanigans. Oh, and ghost shenanigans may be gone. See, right, right I don't here. know about those oh, auto-radicals. Honestly, I don't like them. They haven't been working out. Maybe he knows He knows something. Um, I think it's more just like, uh, you know, a projectile that's going to get sent towards yeah. your opponent, force them to pick an option, yeah. which I can understand. It's fine. But honestly, I feel like with the way that Kles continues to go low, that dropping yeah. down and countering just like a, a much better option. I mean, he's playing. I respect his decision making. Yep, yep, he's yep, yep. Playing. Can't, can't oh. be mad about it. Oh, okay, that's gonna be it. It, it. This scenario, you don't have go, and there you still got a lot of percent to make up. This is kind of rough. This but you gotta Perry work. can do a lot of damage. Look at that. Yep. That's 40. Yep. Okay, now we're He's not done yet either. Do it again. Do it again. Power dunk. Power dunk. Right at the ledge. <laughs> Dude, that would have hit. Come on. <laughs> that's it. Not it yet. No, not yet. Not yet. Okay, one more though. Yeah, trying to land, of course, yeah. Chase on the chase with these nares. Wow. wow. Up B out of disadvantage. And Chase wasn't perfect with the string, so he got hit. Yeah, that is, I mean, it's rare that you see, like, any character really interrupt the, the nair string from, from Paul Utena. Yeah, I, I think it's because he was a little too far, so he, he just tried to get a not true combo, which a lot of characters wouldn't have a button to challenge it. Mm -hmm. It was just a positioning thing. Yeah, and of course, you know, Plus, with the knowledge to, to use that, yeah. utilize okay, the invulnerable AB. One, more, one oh. more hit and we got go. So, we're gonna have to see what happens here. This okay. is super stressful. Yeah, okay, great Tomahawk. No down tilts. Oh, one down tilt, but just a little bit too late. And here we go. Okay. Go. Just here. And Honestly, he's just, in the corner. Yeah, just pressure in the corner. Just keeping your opponent in the corner when you have go <laughs> is such a good tool because it's just applying pressure just oh. by standing there. Okay. Oh, this is so okay. scary. Drift back, counter? No counter. No, no. You don't want to do that in this situation. Like yeah, you have yeah, a guaranteed yeah. kill. Like not even here. I don't think it's worth. Because the way class is recovering, he's just kind of riding the stage. Yeah, it's yeah. Hard. And the down tilts are working for the most part. We're in the corner. Okay, don't get hit by that. Yeah. Class is a very patient player, but mm. kind of throws it out. I, I, I see what he's kind of going for. He was trying to force a full hop jump, and then when people jump from the corner, they tend to land in the same place. Yeah. He tried to catch yeah. them. Yeah. But. It's also like just uh, with the amount of pressure that he applied with the power wave, yeah, yeah. power geyser. Like most players, like you said, their defensive habits would be to either roll or jump. It, it, he, 
Chase had two options right there, or three options, but she chose one of the one of the correct ones. <laughs> he, he had uh, dash in because because Clash showed two options that mm -hmm. he whiffed, jump from the corner, which he didn't do, and, mm -hmm. and he, Clash covered that. Clash covered two options. He didn't cover the third option, which is wait. Yep. So. The old powerful on, shield. Okay, that's a lot of percent. Oh yeah, and that's a jump too, but Clash not able to. Keep up the juggle. Yeah. Ooh, West Smash, all right. <laughs> and what we've seen from the past two games is whoever gets that really early lead and starts building that up is whoever keeps the momentum. Yeah, even though that the other player was able to bring it back at the end, too. Because both games, yeah, yeah, yeah. game one and two, they were both super close. Yeah. No jump, no jump, I think. Mm, does he recognize it, though? Oh, he does. No jump. No jump. Look at Chase go, look at Chase go! He's going. Oh, if, if he got that, it would have sent behind. Still no jump, would have been good, but. And yeah, still, that's a ton of damage on a Kles. Yeah. And we're less than four. You know, never mind. We're, it's go time. All right. Roll oh, the throw. smash four. Roll Let's throw. go. <laughs> Roll the corner grab. I mean, Kles was doing that option a lot. So good on Chase to try it. Sometimes you just got to try it. That's going to be like 40. Yeah. And I respect that. Chase didn't opt to, like, use another jump to pressure Kles. Knowing that he's probably going to crack shoot yeah. and uh, to the other side of the stage. Oh, kind of throwing that uh, out B? there. Okay. But he's got to jump right now again. Oh, yeah. Okay, good, good escape. Good escape. Momentum is definitely in Chase's favor as yeah. Kles is throwing punch after punch, just trying to get in, trying to get something started. There you go, jab, jab, up B. That's yeah. going to take the stock. Best case scenario there would have been to close out the stock uh, before go. But I mean, now he's got to deal with it. He's shown he can deal with it, but Terry is such a such a good comeback character. Oh, for sure. Especially, it only takes like really one interaction, and you're at kill percent, especially when you have go. Yeah. All right, like the down tilt, down tilt back air, yeah. still not dead. No jump, but he'll still make it back. And he's getting, nope, sweet spot. Yeah, Quest showing that Terry really doesn't need the jump to make it back, as long as you let oh, him. Oh, yeah. Common way to die. If you have a projectile, you kind of just project out from the corner. Other person's waiting for it. And again, 45% off the bat Ooh. on the stock. Down oh. smash. Ooh, okay. <laughs> Win box. Okay. Scary. I mean, this is looking rough. The best case scenario is he gets the stock, then he gets to have go for a comeback. Mm -hmm. He can do it. Terry can do it. Klaus can do it. That's is right. he going to do it, though? Oh. The F tilt with a reverse F tilt getting beaten out by the back air. Chase, here we go. Chase in a similar situation. Kles forced to recover a little bit early, making sure that the hitbox is active. Yeah. It was a good early recovery. Because he's been recovering low the whole time. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Jab, jab, up, B. Yeah, not yet. Yeah, great DI from Chase. The next one, though. Oh, oh that's there is no next one. Only an up air. <laughs> Okay, Those yeah. goddess wings come out, and guess what? It's time.